Say that's why. Tossing digi pads out in the trash left and right in order to break through this show via satellite. But I'm good with it. I'm good with it. I never actually checked down here for anything. Oh, oh of course, that's cool. I haven't checked the sewers yet. I'll have to have a look in that. You hear what I'm saying, people? I haven't checked around here either. Whoa, not going in there. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> not in there for a while. Not until I get an upgrade. At least I've got all the evidence I need for my wifey. Meg's mother. So all I need to do now is what's what is the difference between three and four? I need to get in there for three. Four looks like That's it's all. That's far enough. This is a restricted area. Okay. Okay, I better just leave that area completely. Oh, that whole thing is restricted. Right. I do apologize. I'm gonna guess you just give a fuck if I do this. Impossible. Great. I can't go in there yet. God damn it. Not fair. Okay, what's this? 69 credits. To access the Second Avenue Limb Clinic, found their route blocked by supporters. What's up here then? Oh. I'll have a look around fear first. Oh, is that a shotgun? Oh, no, there's office there.
So that just comes out there as well. What's in here? Not on this side. leave that open so I know I've been in there. Oh, 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 oh. updated Saturn but I don't know what because I didn't fully read it everywhere I can in this police station. <laughs> I've been it that way. It's this movie from the 1980s about this cop. He gets all shut up and gets... Hello? Shock on the deck. deck. Both times. Rebel I am. Don't think I really needed to do that, but... Pick up vodka being in there. Oh, where does this go? Oh, I see where this takes me. I don't know where this takes me. Just exploring. Oh, does this take me till the roof? Right. There's a fire escape. 
and I'm back here. Oh well. It's good to know that there's more than one way out the police station. Didn't have to hack it. But I did. What a waste. <laughs> Are they still in shock in there? Yes, they are. <laughs> Have you not noticed, sir? So what is three again? Three is motherly ties. What's on this side? Never checked this side, did I? We're gonna stay here until I get some answers, kid. We're talking about some serious fucking Keep crime. that weapon holster, sir. Crimes? We've had what enough the hell are you doing in here? Crimes? What are you talking about, man? My brother's missing and you want to charge him? Typical. All right, let's... Which one are you? Good cop or bad cop? This is an interrogation room. All right, let's try this again. I recognize you. Sir, industry is secure. Yes, I am. You're making more of a I difference told you. there than It was like a week ago. We was hanging with, with some old friends. Old friends. Listen, we know you both used to run with the Motor City. We know Jason is still in the Oh, where does that go? Oh. Oh. That has lasers. Frickin' laser beams. Come in here with me. We're gonna go this here. We're gonna save it. And we're gonna see what happens. Now I know that there's another way through. I knew that. See? <laughs> now I don't have to trap those stupid laser frickin' beams. Hack this computer. But we'll just use one of those things. Yeah. So we just need to leave here now.
making progress. We are making progress. That is the main thing. Oh, I never checked in here. What's this? Oh, it's a toilet. That's the toilets. Hey, give me a call in a couple of days, okay? No problem. My people have worked tirelessly to find a peaceful solution to this dispute, and I unequivocally deplore the. Are you deaf or just plain stupid? Strong words. You're a real poet. Tell me, is that how you plan to handle the judge when they prosecute you for perjury, possession, and intent to distribute? What the hell are you babbling about, Chrome Boy? Funny story. There's this guy, Blaine Lopez. Deals dope near City Airport. A real scumbag. You know him? Because I have a nice little chat record between him and you. So you want to go to jail? Or you want to tell me what I want to know? How the hell do you... <gasps> Shit, man. Now listen. I, I just did what was asked of me. I, I didn't have a choice. Talk. Okay, look. I just came in one morning and there was an email with my new assignment in it. Official business. But there were also specific instructions. I had to check out the lab for footage from an IntelliCam. They told me to take it and leave it near a garbage can somewhere near the lake. What was on it? Well, it's mm. not crystal clear, but mainly it shows the boys who attacked Seraph as they were breaching the labs. And it looked like they were bringing something in with them. Eh, impossible to tell what. Who asked you to do this? You think I know? Orders are orders around here. They always come from above. And nobody asks questions. You just do what they say, and you hope you don't end up like Secretary Haas over there. Right, so. All the media speculation surrounding that hostage situation. I think that's been done on the police station for now. That's good. Found out all the information I need, surprisingly. Yep. Yeah. So, I need to go to. Three. Yeah. We'll take off five and we'll take off four. Go to three. Watch as. You're here, so I need to go down there. Is it? Is it? I'm here and it's done here. Hmm. The very strange. <laughs> that is so much easier being able to fling at bad boys. Someone's doing some bad driving over here. Let's go and speak to mommy dearest. Should have a look in our bedroom as well. Well, in our, our place. Have you found anything? Please. I've got to know what really happened hmm. to Megan. Complete quest. I've investigated all of Detective Chase's leads. You were right. Something was off with Megan's case. So, what did you find? An officer assigned to the case was asked to get rid of a major piece of evidence. Footage from one of our IntelliCams showed fuzzy images of the attackers bringing something inside the labs. What? What were they bringing in? I don't know. 
But for someone higher up to want that evidence gone, it must have been important. Mm-hmm. I got my hand on a test report that confirms what was bothering Chase. The attackers used excessive measures to make bodies and equipment unidentifiable. Oh my god, Megan. What do you make of this, Adam? I don't know exactly. I guess the idea was to leave no traces, no DNA evidence that would link back to them. But it just seems a bit too convenient. There were only three people who got out of the labs alive. Me and two others. One died in the hospital a few days later. The second one, a lab tech, was ready to give a detailed description of what he saw. Funny thing is, by the time the investigators got to him, he couldn't remember a thing. You sound like you don't believe that. I don't. Not from the reports I've read. I think someone got to him first. Someone in the government, a man named Manderley, ordered that a specially appointed medical examiner perform the autopsy. He bypassed the local ME. Simply put, that's not a good sign. It mm -hmm. sure doesn't sound good. So what you're telling me is we couldn't find anything conclusive? No, I'm sorry. But one thing's for sure. Somebody's been hard at work covering up and destroying evidence related to this case. Somebody with power who wanted to erase anything that might have made the investigation linger. I'm sorry, Cassandra. I wish I had more tangible answers to give you. But I did stumble on something I think you should have. I found Megan's bracelet. I'm sure she'd want you to have it. Oh, Adam, that's very kind of you. Her grandmother gave it to her. She loved that bracelet very much. Thank you for all you did. And, um, do you... Do you know exactly how Megan died? I read the reports. She didn't suffer, Cassandra. I can promise you that. Thank you, Adam. It's not much, but it still brings me some comfort. I miss her so much. Don't worry, Cassandra, this is not over. I don't know how or when, but I will get to the bottom of this. I knew I was right to trust you, Adam. But please, be careful. It's strange. I thought knowing what really happened would make me feel better. But nothing will ever justify this. My daughter is gone, and I'll never get her back. I wish. I wish I could be sure she gets justice. Trust me. She will. Oh, I'll make sure that, honey. I mean, mommy. No offense, but uh, if it were up to me, this place would have a no og policy. I have to break your face. Where are you, Jensen? I haven't gone all night. Hello, Pritchard. I'm almost in my apartment now. Well, when you do get in there, connect the neural hub to your computer. I've created a secure tunnel, and I'll take over remotely. You can access my personal computer. Who do you think configured your security protocols? Hello? All the media circulation surrounding that hostile situation in Detroit has just blown through the roof. Thanks to the arrival of William Taggart, celebrity author and founder of... Oh well, let's go upstairs. Hopefully this doesn't continue too much. I'm gonna stay here. I don't want to leave this place yet. I'm quite happy just wandering around the city. Detroit City. They're locked. Mr. Jensen, I fixed up your apartment real nice. <laughs> Thank you. The good Lord made you in his own image. Why would you desecrate yourself? No, oh, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Good Lord did not give you a no, mobile phone. It? Why use it? I can't believe you can. Welcome home, Mr. Jensen. <laughs> wow, what a beautiful place we have here. <laughs> Magic gnomes. <laughs> Why have I got kids cereal when 
I don't have a cat. Cigarettes. Baseball. Anything hidden under here? No. Ooh. May you heal quickly. What type of cards is this? Oh. Call landlord and replace Murr again. Hmm. I think Jensen might have gotten a little bit angry about his augmentations. He obviously doesn't like the look of them. That's my personal computer. Don't want to. Ooh, combat rifle. Oh, gene killer's nice. Recognizing any of those drones. Alright, personal computer. Pritchard, the hub's connected. I know. Now be quiet and let me concentrate. I need his name, Pritchard, not his entire genetic history. That's not his DNA. It's the data he was trying to steal from us before he. My god, Jensen. Your suicide hacker didn't kill himself. You obviously didn't see his brain spidered all over the floor. No, no, you don't understand. The wet drive modification in this chip, it allows someone to hack through you. It turns you quite literally into a human proxy. So he wasn't working alone. Someone off-site was doing the actual hacking. Exactly. And whoever it was tried to hide his location by using multiple satellites. But I may have just traced him to here, an abandoned factory complex in Highland Park. Get me the address, Pritchard. Because if we're lucky, whoever pulled our terrorist strings might still be there. Ooh. What, what? It. Adam, I'm so sorry if Megan died, nobody knew what to do with Rebecca, so I took him in, but I, could, I couldn't keep him and nobody knew if you were up for week, so I don't know what else to do. I'm really sorry. Here's a sweet dog. Hey, what? You got rid of my dog? Fucking dicks. Wait, wait, what? Ooh. All right. Just a quick note to work into the new apartment. If you need anything or something and it's not satisfied, please don't hesitate to let me know, and I will pass it on to the building management. Code is five three seven five. If your key is lost or damaged, I will back it up. Blah 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 blah. That's supposed to be Jensen and Megan. I'm guessing. Adam, it's David. Let me guess. You're sending me to Highland Park. Not just yet. Frank's figured out why the network's been compromised. There's a persistent transmission coming from Derelict Row. Street gang territory? Well, our dead friend was posing as an Antioch. Who better to hide with than the D-Row ballers? Right. I'm on my way. Put a face on you, dog. Yes. Some face you got on you. Right. Eh, uh, what mission we're gonna do? 
activate mission four as well. And oh. Jensen, I'd appreciate it if you instructed your street informants to use more conventional means of contacting you. What are you talking about, Pritchard? I mean, I found a message stapled to your door. Colo, alley off Bagley Avenue, Ezekiel. How cryptic. That's near Seraph HQ. I'll look into it. Oh, and it's Cholo. Hmm, <laughs> Cholo. Oh well. And I am going to call that the end of the stream tonight. We'll create a new save. We made a little bit of progress here tonight. Is that you off the bed, is it? Yeah. Okay. So, I hope you enjoyed the stream tonight. Thank you to everyone who joined in. And we will hopefully catch you next time. So, bye for now.